In the last month, Aptera has made significant strides in developing its three-wheeled solar electric vehicle. CEO Chris Anthony provided an update highlighting the progress made. The company has completed its alpha development phase, resulting in three prototype solar electric vehicles. These prototypes serve as a proof of concept, validating the design and engineering, and giving customers a preview of the final production vehicles. Aptera offers three standard exterior colors, Noir, Black, Sol, White, and Luna, Silver, along with three interior options, Vita, Coast, and Codex. Building on the alpha phase, Aptera is now advancing to the beta phase, planning to construct between 6 and 12 beta vehicles. These beta vehicles are essential for accelerating the ramp up to production, integrating production parts, and making further design refinements. A notable change in the beta vehicles is the increase in size, which offers more headroom and side space for enhanced driving comfort. Despite being larger, aerodynamic optimizations have reduced drag, improving efficiency over the alpha prototypes. Testing during the alpha phase revealed opportunities to optimize various aspects of the vehicle, including stability, turning radius, and maneuverability. To expedite the production process, Aptera has partnered with Roush Engineering for the development of high-quality automotive components such as the suspension, door system, and window mechanisms. The suspension has seen significant improvements, with slimmer control arms in the front suspension enhancing aerodynamics. The cable routing for the in-wheel motors has been refined, using smaller cables that fit under aerodynamic covers. Additionally, the rear suspension has been upgraded from a single-sided swing arm to a double-link suspension, offering better performance. Aptera has completed the body and white tooling for the beta vehicles, and parts are currently being manufactured. The company is also making progress in solar composite manufacturing, designing highly efficient and durable solar panels capable of withstanding environmental conditions while minimizing power losses. These solar panels, designed to last at least 10 years, have undergone rigorous testing, including hail impact, durability, and electroluminescence tests. As solar technology advances, Aptera plans to offer upgrades to enhance the vehicle's solar range. The beta development efforts will continue at Aptera's new facility in Carlsbad, California. These vehicles, focused on functionality and safety testing, will undergo extensive testing and certification with various vendors worldwide. The company is rapidly expanding its team and encourages those interested in contributing to a greener future to explore job opportunities on their LinkedIn page. Aptera has also begun production intent builds for its three-wheeled solar EV, although the delivery timeline remains uncertain. CEO Steve Fambro mentioned partnering with Italy's CPC Group, known for its quick establishment of a carbon fiber body production line. The start of production for the launch edition vehicles requires additional capital, and Aptera plans to provide more details on delivery timelines soon. This indicates that the production start may be delayed to 2025. Despite this, Aptera clarified that the initial phases of production, funded through the Accelerator program, include building production intent vehicles. The company is working with CPC Group to assemble chassis and suspension components using assembly jigs, eventually transitioning to automated assembly with high-volume robots. They also tease a crash simulation for the body structure and are eager to compare it to the production intent build. The launch edition of Aptera's Solar EV, revealed in January 2023, features a 42 kilowatt hours battery pack providing up to 400 miles of range, a solar system offering 700 watts of continuous power for 40 miles of range per day, and a 0 to 60 enough acceleration time of 4.0 seconds. Aptera has chosen the Tesla NACS port for charging, staying ahead of the recent trend among American EV brands. In summary, Aptera is making remarkable progress in developing its three-wheeled solar electric vehicle, moving from alpha to beta testing, enhancing design and efficiency, and working towards production. The company's efforts include significant improvements in suspension, aerodynamics, and solar panel technology, with a focus on functional and safety testing. Aptera's new facility in Carlsbad, California, will play a crucial role in test developments. Despite potential delays, the company is committed to refining its vehicle design, ensuring efficiency and cost-effectiveness, and achieving its production goals. That's where we wrap things up for the time being. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.